So we finished the ghost gym, and now we're moving on to getting into the ruins, it looks like? I gotta fight Beat again. That wasn't even a great catch, Beat. Just relax. Erosion. I forgot. What does she have again? She's got a lot of fairy type. Or psychic. She's just got a lot of psychic type. Bug, dark, ghost. Shit. I just swapped all of my dark types back into my bag. He's a boy? Really? I've met like 10 chicks like this. I mean, he's wearing a pink jacket and a pink shoes. Am I allowed to be confused? My bad. Oh my goodness, she's so beautiful. I think she had her last time. Oh wait, no, you know what I recognize her from, Steven? It's when we were playing Pokemon in Discord one time. And it was like, named as Pokemon, and I was like, I have no idea what it is, but it's so cute. Remember that? Do you remember that? <laughs> then I was Googling it like, I want one. These are the cutest Pokemons in the entire world. I love it. Well, first we have to fight B before we can move on. Some people say, well, she do he does. I know 10 old women that look just like that and have that exact coat on. And those reverse knee pads. Like, I've, like I know people. Adult, uh, like adult women. Older women. Dress exactly like that, so that's why I'm confused. I'm sorry. He's an angry boy, though. Like, why are they behind your knees? What are they for? You have sweaty knees. You need like some like airflow back there. Is that what's happening? Sounds like it. Sounds like he is. Is that the chairman finally wearing a suit? When you asked to borrow out Chairman Rose's copper jaw, I can't believe you tried to use the chairman's Pokemon to destroy a historical site. Seriously. Who cares for some ancient ruin the next thousand years are at stake? How do you expect to support the chairman with that sort of thinking? Young Bead. It pains me to say this, but I am disappointed. It's true that I'm the one who found you back when you were all alone. I saw talent in you. You reminded me a little bit of myself. I mean, I think all the rivals in this game are good in their own way. At least Chairman Rose doesn't have his short shorts on again. <laughs> That's why I sent you to a trainer school, to give you a chance at success. But trying to destroy the mural... You show no love towards Galar. You are not a worthy challenger for the gym challenge. <gasps> we will decide what to do with you later for now you return to Hammerlock. Oh my goodness, right in front of all these people? There are a hundred different ways we could sort this out. Why are you choosing the worst possible option? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That seems so cruel. Absolute disaster. I never wish to see us lose challenges for this sort of reason. Yet we do what we must do to keep things fair and sportsmanlike. It was Rose who took Bede under his wing, and so Bede was battling for the chairman's sake. Yeah, Michael, isn't that. I mean, what an awful turn of events. I hope the mural survived all that. I don't. I wanted to go back in that cave. Oh. My goodness! I guess it didn't. Hey, look, the sword and the shield! Two kings and the two doggos. 
It was like she put something together there. She figured something out. Not a brilliant turn of events, but the ruins were brought onto the light for us to see. What does this tell us about Galar's legends? A sword and a shield. Right, more than any hero, there's those things that appear to be Pokemon who stand out. Not just that, but they appear to be holding a sword and a shield as if they were using them. Anything like it? Nope. The hero is actually two people. Really, two heroes. Why is there only one statue with the bird you would drop in? Ooh, that's a good question. More than any statue of a hero or old tapestry, these ruins made in truly ancient times must show us the real truth. What? Ah! The shield is a Pokemon! Combined. But the two actual Pokemon treated us the same thing, but then what, they just faded from history? Why would the truth of these ruins be hidden when their stories were depicted in artwork? Take you a couple of these. So you'll be doing your best. You'll be headed to Balan Leah. Yeah, I guess so. Thanks for the revive. She keeps giving me revives and I've never even used one. Knock on wood, as soon as I say that, I'll need to use like 10. <laughs> She definitely is the daughter. Alright, well. This is like the intro music to YMCA. Do you, do you hear it? Do you hear it? Right, now we can finally probably go down this path. I saw the new bit I'm off for a minute. <laughs> Latest day one. Game Break doesn't do metal games anymore ever since Black and White. I'm ready to acquire some steel poison types. Hop in the Pokeball, Morgrim. It's level 34. He might not hop in. I don't want to, like, instantly kill him. Maybe I will just hit him with a waterfall. I don't think that'll do too much damage to him. What did he do? He, like, made my... He raised some... You arose my attack, but you confused me. Cool. You're kidding! Use. Um, anti confusion. Wow, this little imp is gonna. Kick my giant danger fish in his butt. No! He won't get in the ball. I guess I could have tried a great ball, but like, I can't. This is so frustrating. Okay, I'm switching over to like Haunter or something that's a lower level. So I can just hit it a little bit without destroying it. The thorn here it is. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta bump you over to third place there. Okay. 
Come here, Impy 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 Imp boy. Ooh, a hat trim. Like she had one of those, she had, Bead had one of these. All right. Hmm, I don't want to do anything that's too effective, but they're the same level, so it probably won't knock them out in one. Aromatherapy? Am I gonna fall asleep? Did my move fail? I guess I want to do Hex. Oh! Oh, perfect, perfect, yes! If you light a particular mushroom, it attracts you towards you. Which mushroom do I have to light? How do I... Oh, no. How do I light a mushroom? Just touch it? Which mushroom? What color mushroom do I need to touch? It literally has one health. How am I supposed to... The pink ones? Cool. to do about this stupid Hatchim. Do I have a ball that's like more effective against... Dusk Ball. Maybe? Do premier balls work pretty good? Let's try it. She has one HP. Like, I don't know what to do. Title is day. So what happens when you overshoot your title is ball and then you find it in a pile with 37 other title is balls. You just take them all home with you or not. I'll just, I'm just gonna go back to Great Balls. I don't know what else to do. I got a Pokemon to 1 HP and I slept it and I still couldn't catch it. This was just ball jokes. I mean, you can use ball jokes if you like. Ball jokes, yeah. Berries, maybe? Oh, right. In Pokemon Go, that's what I do too. All right, I'm just gonna use this ball again. All my Pokemon are dead now. What the frick? Literally, what the frick? Took like 10 balls to get this stupid. And all my dudes are passed out. I know, but I switched to poison because the next gym is fairy. And so my, I'm gonna be weak against poison and steel. I need to catch myself some poison and steel types, but like, I want some cute fairies out of the wilderness while I'm here. There's so much cute stuff here. I'm not like trying to build a psychic deck, or a deck, or whatever. Alright, just, I guess I'm gonna hold on, I gotta go. Um. 
Anyways, I don't need any of that. Um, got some fossils. Let me see, medicine, yeah, I'll just use whatever I've got in here that's random. Okay, fine, I'll just use a revive, whatever. Regular potion, just only super potions. Feels like a waste, but whatever. It's not like I'm not. It's not like I'm broke or anything. Okay, now that we've wasted a bunch of time on that crap, let's see here. Heck yeah, let's just battle these kids. You guys want to go? I'm in the mood to fight some humies. Riolu. I do have a. Corvus Knight. I have the bird. I don't have him evolved at all, but I can totally throw some uh, EXP candies at him, some XP candies, and blow him up. Hey, dope! So it's for you, Big V. That was really funny earlier. Your messages were all really messed up. Truly is so gorgeous. Shit, wasted my move with Toxic Boy. Unless he gets an attack with Nine Tails. Nope, wasted. Arr. Darn. Oh, wait. Oh, good, I still get you. Dope. Well, shit, okay, well, shit. Daring couple. Seven G's? Stoked. Alright, I need to go poke a pink flower. I'll go see what this is. Ooh! I was hoping you were the stupid hat one, because the hat type is stuck. Do a little hex. You're fine, baby. Darn it, not into the yellow yet. Woof. Hunter, we gotta figure something out about you, fam. You got problems. Thanks for the host, though. I don't have any fairy type. I have the one I just caught. Maybe? I'm just here to catch stuff. I'm not, you know... I guess I could equip some fairy types that I have, but they're all gonna be level nothing. Thanks to the host lights. <laughs> That's really funny. Gengars are, yeah, they are glass cannon. They're still some of my favorites in Pokemon Go. Seriously? Just get in there. Oh my goodness. Psychic and Psychic Fairy. Hatena and Hatton. Hatna and Hatton. Is that the two, um, is that the first in the evolved? Oh, Hattern. Hatterine. What is 
just want to get some different types. Like, I don't have any psychic or fairy or anything. Like, all I have is... Woof. Alright, you're in Gyarados. Maybe I'll just run through the Tangled Forest and come back later. I don't know. Oh good, not very effective. Perfect. Spritzy! I wanna catch a Spritzy. So Spritzy is a fairy type. And the one I just caught otherwise was a psychic type. No. Maybe what I should do is put the two I just captured... on my team. At least then they just won't be as oh susceptible. You have to hold something and trade? That sucks. I just want something that's less susceptible to psychic and fairy types and then just all can so I want to run up to a pink mushroom. Oh, I'm already out! Oh, I have one. Something. What do you have to hold, Danny, to get it to level up? Haunter only requires a trade? Well, so I don't get it. I trade him to someone else, and then he evolves, and then they just trade him back? So much work to evolve something. There we go. Just gonna beat Bort back into the Glimwood Tangle. Should be a pink one on the other side. I'm gonna go look for it. I don't know what touching the green ones does, but I'm gonna get a I'm gonna touch a pink one. Shoot, how do I get up there? Already defeated them. I came from there. Well, I did win in the battle cafe. So I just need to give it to Spritzy? Okay. What's that? I can't. Get to okay, do I have to? 
here, I guess. That's fine. We'll battle her. Some mushrooms react in weird ways when you touch them. Yep, I believe that. This is all Glimwood Tangle stuff. Oh, did I go too far, movie? Phantom 2? This is, this is exhausting. I'm just gonna go ahead and swap over. I only wanted the little guys on the main part so that I could use them against the stuff that's in the jungle, but if I'm gonna do a bot, like a fight with another person, I'm not gonna waste my time. I'm just gonna like, knock them down. I'm not super concerned about the spritzy, you guys. I'm okay. There was a different one I was Oh, oh, Haunter, that's the one I do want to know. Haunter's the one I'm into. You've touched the pink mushrooms to get an imp, which is what I want, because I want to trade it with that guy. That's super cool, Lex. You just have to trade him? Okay. Yeah. The next one- well, I look kinda like- the next one's Opal, right? Hey! Morgrim! I want him so bad! I really want a Morgrim. What type is Morgrim? Oh, he's really high level. Oh, an infidim is a baby Morgrim. Gen five, six, seven, eight. Oh, okay, this this gen. Green snarl. Dark and fairy type. Any damage to him at all? Well, give, the, give it a shot. <laughs> Sometimes they go straight in, grab your fingers. Opal is my least favorite gym to battle. Yeah, her team is first a Weezing, then a Mawile, then a Tochikiss, and finally a G Max Alchemy. Perfect, I want my Hatchim. Come on, I haven't even 
managed to use one move yet. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. That's all I wanted. Oops. There goes Hatchroom. Thanks for trying, Hat Hat. She throws random questions in during battle that alter your Pokemon status if you get them wrong. Seriously? Woof. Sorry, Hatchum, you got zero points. I love you, sir. You are adorable. You don't mimic him. Your name is perfect. Of a Morgrim. I'm super happy. <laughs> this place is really pretty. So where can I get steel types now? I need to get some... my bird. I have a bird. Oh! Oh, Alolan. I don't think my normal bug trio is. It's just the Alolan type. Galarian Meowth is a steel type, I guess. He's only a level 14, though. In the bridge area. <clears throat> Wait, so I need to go back to the wild area and go to the bridge. That's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna go back to the wild area because I want one of those elephants. That's the super coolest thing I've ever seen. Wait, which bridge area? Bridge field?
Listen, I can catch him anywhere, but... Hello, beastie. Mistress! Don't ruin my morning. That's an ad. Sorry about that. Um, I feel like I can get him anywhere. But there's a higher chance of catching him when there's a snowstorm. Alright, I'll pop over there. Maybe I'll pop back. Hi, Mark. How's it going? Bug and flying type. I don't need that at all. Waba Fett, Waba Fett Sudowoodo. A bunch of Waba Fetts and Sudowoodos. That weird pumpkin thing that I definitely don't want. Let me see, what's this big boy's name? Hey, it just says a wild Cormanite. You think I can catch him? I think I might be able to. Oh, only be caught in the bridge field area. Okay, well, my, my thing must be wrong. He looks terrifying. I'd love to have one. Oh, I switched the wrong Pokemon in. But I don't want to knock him out. I just want to... Dope! I just want to get him, like, five or six bites on him without my Gyarados passing out. Although he might. But Humper could knock him out easy. But I don't want to knock him out. I want to take him home. That'd be so cool to take him home. Wow, he instantly broke free. Love that. Oof. Okay, I'll bite him again. He's making Gyarados so mean. They're both flying types, so that's good. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. He's not even staying in for like two seconds. Seriously, right, Lex? Like he's a fish. Like he just flies through the water. <laughs> what is my stream title? <laughs> ah. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Hell yes! Woo! Okay, dope. So now I have a level 38 Corvid at night. That was super worth it. It was super worth it to come here. Definitely. What do you got for me? <laughs> oh, maybe not. 80 and 100. Oh. Ooh, yeah. Switch out. Stupid nuzzle. Dude, seriously, Mega. Oh, you're pretty boy. Corbin Knight. Dope. You're gonna be my main boy. What is he again? Dark and fairy? I don't think I need him at all. Yeah, he's literally gonna be weak at, at the gym I'm going to, but I just like him. 
Well, we'll figure it out later. Dope. Okay, now I wanted to go and find... The bridge area? I legit... Like, this bridge right here? Is that what you mean? Because I feel like there's a couple of bridge areas. Floating ice cream cones. Sneasels. Little blue two-legged pandas. A bunch more pandas. I don't know what that is, but I want it. It looks dope. Oh no, strong looking, run! Bridge field when you enter, sweet. Okay, I didn't realize it was a level 51, we're running, I promise. Real oh no, I don't want him. I don't want him. Quit. Thank you. That's a vulture, and I want it so bad. Come here. Look at how pretty it is. Please don't say da. Of course, it's so strong looking. Why would it not say strong looking? My friend keeps catching and trading vanillish names. You got coned? That's hilarious. Wait, I thought I ran! Well, I know, but some of the stuff in the wild doesn't require it. Like, I just got the Corviknight. He was floating out in the wild. He wasn't too big boy. Too big of a boy. Panda Buzz looked dope, dude. I want him. I got it. You want it? I got it. I like my hair. Gee, thanks. Just bought it. Just see it? I like it. Mm, I think I just ran away. Oh. My goodness, that's $600. Just spent $600 on the ground. Alright, I'm heading to this bridge area. Oh, snuffle up, I guess this is. Stony wilderness. Machokes for days. There's machokes everywhere in this map. <laughs> that looks like another flying steel corviknight boy, but I don't need two. Although I bet if I did was a three star, I don't know if I can do it myself. Shit ton of machokes. Pro gunk. Whatever that is. What is that guy? No, 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 no. Not the stupid Lanoon or Zigzagoon. I recently sucked out my Corviknight for the Dancing Max Charizard. No, yeah, that sounds amazing. That's what she was talking about. She, Yeah, it's all extensions. Her hair, because it's so long, you can tell. I mean, looks great, though. This guy. I want this guy. I don't know what he is, but I like him. I see him. I like him. I want him. I got him. What is he? <laughs> it's one hundred. Yeah, no, it's one hundred percent a. Uh, go left. Oh no! I instantly knocked him out. I didn't want to do that. He's a ground ghost type. Oh. Well, I wanted to keep him then. Oh my gosh, get me out of here. No, I don't want any of this crap. I'd take that boy, but he's probably too strong for me. What's this boy? Oh, a big stupid stu bridge field area. Here we go. Stupid, stupid chipmunk a-hole. Alright, I'm ready for an elephant boy to spawn. Hello, elephant boy. Those are stupid sneezels. Any elephant boys? That looks like a bat. That looks like a big icicle. What about over here? Bat, icicle.
gossip with that I suppose Zigzagoon a big beefy boy that looks like a stupid panda I'm gonna bump into him and see what it says dang it beware all right I guess we'll run Ooh, a shiny Sneasel that's really cool you couldn't get away Okay, well, I'd like to run. Thank you. Goodness. It's like trying to teach me a lesson about, like, charging up on those big boys. But I literally just did it to get this Corviknight. So, like, I don't feel bad about it. I would like an elephant baby, please. What's this boy selling? Sure. Oh wow, totally worth it. Hello there. What are you guys talking about? Hello here, little boy. Okay, I'd like the it is, it's a snowstorm right now, so he has a 10% chance to spawn. Ah! What the shit is that? Is that garbage dump guy? This is the trash trash pile man, right? <coughs> hey, Garbador! He's not a strong looking Garbador, I might be in the kitchen. Oh, I'm thinking of Trubbish. Does Trubbish evolve into Garbador? Garbador tends to break free and use explosion. <clears throat> Wait, what? Shit. I mean, he looks like a big old boy. I captured him. Oh, he instantly broke free. I want the the font, the baby. Maybe I'll just wait till the snowstorm knocks him down. <laughs> wow, he's not even staying in there for two seconds. So gross, I really want him though. Here we go. Dang it. Dang it. Coupon doesn't spawn in snow or rain. If you want, you can quickly change the date in your switch settings and turn off your internet clock so the weather will change and then change it back. Oh, dope. That's a great idea. <laughs> Makes everyone want a lot of trash. I don't think anyone ever wants a lot of trash. Okay, is he never gonna stay in there? I've used like eight great balls. Ooh, Corviknight might not make it. I thought someone that has a shiny El Elsus? El Asus? Oh my gosh, I really want him. I want him crap. Look at him, he's hilarious. He's about to get knocked out by just the hail. So is Corbin Knight. Mm -hmm. 
Dude, it doesn't affect four when I figure it out. Shit. What just happened there? Shit. I want this garbage man. I want my garbage boy. I've used like 10 Pokeballs on him. And he has got pretty, pretty low health a couple of times. Is so he ever gonna stay in, the, in, the, in this great fall? Oh, he's never gonna. Gyarados is messed up right now. That's it, folks. We're done for the day. I caught my Garbodor. Uninstall. <laughs> Unplug the game. <laughs>